Hey boss, the game's becoming out really nice. You wanna see what I've been working on? Kate Six really is a good looking dude. Uh boss. Are you listening? Do you wanna see what I've been working on or not? Six? Uh, no. I was just working on the grimoire cards. I'm trying to take them to the next level, where instead of just having it online, we'll have it work within the game. Players can not only collect ghosts, but then see those grimoire cards inside the game so they learn the story as they're playing. But what about Kate Six? <sighs> I didn't focus on it. But sir, Cade Six, Cade Six. How's the progress with everything coming along? Oh hey, it's going pretty good, boss. I'm just trying to figure out the best way to have really good in-game content so the players keep playing. But why? That's not even important. to learn. That's what DLC is for. Why give players a complete game and we can just make them pay for the end game later? Because that's what's going to keep our players playing for longer. Don't argue with me. Remember what I told you that Ian Destiny 2 stands for? I said remove them. I want all players to be equal in Destiny 2. The Ian Destiny 2 is for equality.
just say four months? Yes. Four months. Four. Four. All right, well, since you're such a big fan of fours all of a sudden, how about you scrap all the work that you've done and all the game modes will now be 4v4. No more wasting your time with different game modes with different amounts of people. Everything will be 4v4. But sir, won't scrapping all my hard work that I've done with the 3v3s and the 6v6 and having to start over and do 4v4 take more time than it me just finishing what I'm working on now? Yeah, hmm. You're actually right for once. Hmm. <sighs> so, uh, can I just continue with the work that I'm doing, please? You know what? I have a better idea. Players will only be able to choose between competitive and quick play, and within those two, there will be two different game modes for each that players will be able to select at random. So basically, they'll have no choice in which gameplay they're going to play each time. But... <sighs> Won't that prevent players from choosing exactly what they want if they can't just go in and select control or select clash? You're going to make it all be random and have no choice in the matter? I know what's best for the Destiny community. Now get to work. Hey guys, just wanted to chime in real quick, especially for the ones that are new, and just let you guys know that even though I make these videos, I really do love Bungie, I love Destiny, and I hope that they do get things right. It's just Destiny's not in a good place right now, so I really like making these humor videos about how Destiny 2 came to be. But overall, Destiny's still my favorite game ever, and I know that they're going to get it right at some point. I wish that I could help Bungie. I'm about to graduate college, and I did apply for them, but as you can see, they don't want my help, so they'll have to get it right on their own. But thank you guys for all the support. I really, really do appreciate everything you guys have done for my channel. We broke 2,300 subs, which is awesome. So I just hope you guys have a happy Thanksgiving. Or if I put this video out after Thanksgiving, I hope you had a happy Thanksgiving. I'm not sure when this is coming out yet, so I'm going to stop talking now. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. More will come. Get in the comment box below. Let me know if you do enjoy these skit videos and if you want to see more. And with that, I'm going to talk to you guys in the next Destiny video. Thanks. Love all of you guys. Thank you.